सो ही गाइज वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल फॉर ट्यूटोरियल्स सो गाइज टूडे आई टीच यू हाउ टू क्रिएट मोग्राफ डायनेमिक एनिमेशन विद यूजिंग सिनेमा फोर डी सी गाइज दैट्स माई रियली कूल एनिमेशन राइट सो गाइज इट्स टू पार्ट ऑफ ट्यूटोरियल सो गाइज फर्स्ट पार्ट इज दैट्स माई फर्स्ट टाइप ऑफ एनिमेशन दिस वन आई विल टीच यू हाउ टू क्रिएट दिस टाइप ऑफ इफेक्ट दैट्स माई फर्स्ट पार्ट राइट इट्स रियली कूल डायनेमिक इफेक्ट एंड गाइज स्टॉप सो इट्स माई सेकेंड वन so again play right okay so guys now stop and guys i create new project new project check so firstly guys go to on file and merge so guys import 3d model like this see guys that's my cup 3d model so guys it's too much bigger so smaller so select the scale size and guys smaller check little bit more up yeah right see guys that's my cup and guys now next one i use this time animator animator check so guys select your cup 3d model and make child with animator so guys select this animator firstly guys see that's my show object check and guys play yeah it's good and increase frame frame i like 500 is good and now guys go to pack so go to on here birth editor i like 20 and render i like 20 yes and go to on here stop emission guys stop emission same 500 and go to on here so guys see that's my speed speed i like zero so rotation rotation 360 360 check and go to on here variation variation randomly like a 30% and guys play yeah see guys that's my simple effect right okay so guys stop and now go to on back So guys, I apply this time rigid body tag on animator, simulation tag, and rigid body. So guys, go to on force here. That's my rigid body tag, and follow position. I like zero point five, and guys play. Yeah, great. See guys, that's my effect, right? And now guys, I take camera. So go to on here camera check, and guys select your camera. So guys, all rotation I like zero, and Position change minus two thousand is good, and play, yeah, good, right? Okay, so guys, now I change gravity. So see guys, that's my gravity effect. So go to one mode project and go to one dynamic and gravity. I like zero, and again go to back and play, yeah. See guys, that's my first animation, first type of effect. So guys, now little bit change seed. So guys, again go to an animator and go to on here seed this one like a one randomly and play, yeah, right. See guys, that's my effect. Okay, so guys, now go to on here. That's my rigid body tag and bake or dynamic check. See guys, that's my baking. Okay, so guys, my baking is finished and again play, yeah. Okay, so guys, my animation is finished. That's my first step. So next one, guys, I apply this time delay factor tool. So stop and guys clear catch it check. So guys select your animator and I apply this time delay for more spring type of effect. So strength I like sixty five and mode I like spring. So guys select this animator and include. So guys drag and drop on here like this and play. Yeah, right. Okay, so guys, my first step is complete. That's my first type of animation, and now, guys, second one, I create like a simple attractor effect. So go to on back, and now, guys, I take spare. So guys, spare radius hundred is good. Segments increase like a thirty two, and guys, next one, go to on simulate. So go to on force and use attractor. So guys, select this attractor and make child with spare this one. And guys, now so strength I like two thousand. Strength two thousand and mode change like a force. So guys, next one play. Okay, see guys, that's not correct. So stop. And guys, firstly I apply this time vibrator tag on spare. So guys, check vibrator check and go to on position. Position I like randomly like a one thousand, all one thousand, right? 
and frequency are like 0 0.5 and guys enable rotation check so rotation all 360 and 360 check so guys frequency 0 0.5 and lastly guys select this pair this one and right click go to an simulation tag and i apply collider body tag so guys again play yeah see guys that's my second dynamic animation right it's looking really beautiful that's my dynamic effect okay so guys stop and now guys my animation is really cool and guys next one you can apply material load material guys i have cinema 4d studio light and material so i apply yellow material on cup like this and guys like a purple spear so guys go to pack and play yeah see guys that's my really cool dynamic effect and now lastly guys i apply cinema 4d studio light file and merge select this light and close select this flow and background so go to down like this and guys select the softbox this one go to and back out of camera yes and guys lastly select this camera and right click guys lock this camera yeah and guys play yes see guys that's my final dynamic animation that's my really cool effect and now guys stop go to on render setting so guys i use mb occlusion global illumination and indirectly catch i like low and t select best and max level i like two so output i like all frame this one and guys use presets that's my only sd part so guys save and i like jpeg sequences so guys create new folder like this enter and take any file name like this yes right okay so guys play that's my final work right okay so guys stop and guys uh, before render so guys go to one here and bake all dynamic check okay so guys that's it my final work is finished so guys if you like my video please share and please subscribe my youtube channel thank you